Hi, my name is Benjamin Moore. We're here with another uh, episode in Devotional for Smart Truth. Uh, I am the program assistant here, as long with another litany of other hats I get to wear for different jobs, including lifeguard during the summer. Uh, I was just asked to look at uh, some of the devotional aspects um, that I've been going through. And one, seriously, that personally I need to even take more advantage of, but Christians throughout history have struggled with would be prayer. Um, 1 Peter 3, 12 says, For the eyes of the Lord are over the righteous, and his ears are open unto their prayers. But the face of the Lord is against them that do evil. Um, I've kind of been struck with the importance of realizing that God hears you. Um, going through life and just floating through, realizing that you know, I have a God that cares and listens to my problems and even the things that I don't consider important, but he feels are. Uh, he's there to not only comfort me, give me wisdom, but just to have somebody to listen to. And a lot of people turn to God when it's too late or if we look around us in the world, it's there's a big virus happening and doom and gloom and it's just it's all despair or negativity and then we turn to God when when all seems lost um, and I mean this has been happening throughout human history for a long time even the disciples you know the, the ship is sinking when they're crossing the Sea of Galilee and when all hope is lost they cry out Lord save us when Christ is sleeping in the boat and uh you know, only only when all hope was lost, they cried out to God. Not not when the storm was just going on or uh, not when maybe the, the clouds were brewing. They didn't call out for help. It was only when they didn't have another option or when Christ was about to be crucified. And uh, he asks, Christ asked the disciples to stay up with him just to pray. <laughs> and we as humans, we couldn't even do that. You know, we couldn't. They, the disciples couldn't stay awake to pray. They fell asleep. And uh, we have a really powerful God and a powerful mediator who's there to uh, hear us when we pray. And we don't take advantage of that. Again, this is just something that's God puts on my heart. I'm very convicted of the fact that I don't call on him enough. And... Uh, that's just something I want to challenge everyone who's listening, just to take prayer seriously. I know especially it's easier to think about it now, but um, as we continue and life goes back to normal again, whatever your normal may be, but to take prayer seriously and take advantage of that because he hears you and he's ready to answer. Thank you.